Hello, today we are going to learn about joints. So mainly what is the meaning of joints and what are, what are the types of joints we used in SQL. This all we are going to learn about today. So before going to the topic, if you are visiting my channel for the first time, please do subscribe. Uh, now let's start the topic. See, joints, join means say clubbing. So combining the data means joins, right? So here in the database terms, if you see, if we want to join the multiple tables and in the tables, what are all the columns based on which columns we need a data? So what are the common columns we have and what is the common data we have that all, how do we retrieve the data? So that we'll see based on joins. Okay. So now let's start uh, doing uh, executing these joins. Okay. So first of all, what uh, how many types of joins we have in SQL? Like first is inner join, and then left outer join, and then right outer join. Okay. Here only we'll see. Okay, right outer join and full outer join. So these many and also cross join. Okay, so these many types of joins we have inner and these three and this one. Okay, so total five types of joins we have in SQL. So one by one, by one we will see now. So first of all inner join. Okay. So how do we execute? Before going to the uh, in joins, first of all, we'll check the data in a tables. What are the columns we have and what type of records we have? Okay. So select star from company table. I'm taking here for example. Okay. So how many columns and records we have? Here we have total eight records, right? So we don't have any foreign keys here. So now, if you want to join any column, then you should have a foreign key in other table. Any one of the table, you should have a, a foreign key. Okay. So next, the another table which I am going to take as an example, like department. So we will we'll also, this also will try to execute this. Now let's see here. This is ID and department and then employee ID. This is a foreign key of this company column ID. Okay. So this is the employee ID. Fine. So now we'll start executing the joins. Select first I want to get the data based on what are the common columns, uh, sorry, common records we have in both the department and company tables. Okay. So that we will see uh, company select. Okay. I'll select columns later because I'll show you how to write that columns as well with alias names. Okay. From company company alias name I am keeping it as a C ok now what are the details I want to get C dot ID means inside the company the ID and C dot name so these columns are belongs to company column ok C dot salary ok so these details I want to get from company table ok now in a join in a join which table department right so department for department I am giving alias name as a D okay on so here C dot means company okay C dot ID equal to D dot employee ID this is the common right foreign key we have so here D dot EMP underscore ID so now whatever the columns we have in both I mean common records we have in both the tables that details we will get it in a join means combining that common data how to get it okay see here uh, let's say here in the columns we, we will get d dot 
emp underscore id means inside the department table and also d dot dept department also we will try to get so that you will get a clear idea on it see here these three ids were matching with these three ids okay so that is why we were getting common data from the both the tables okay so this is about inner join next same columns we take same let me take same and then we'll execute left outer join okay we can give left join as well left outer also anything you can keep no problem both will execute i'll show you that also see now here whatever see on condition right after on what is the condition expression we are giving based on that the query will get execute so here left side equal to uh, for equal what is the left side is there that column data will display all the data will display okay but which are match with the right side that also will display okay so this is about left join let's execute so that you will get a clear idea see here and you can execute same result will get see here eight rows not affected right i have removed outer also and then only i kept left join same eight rows affected see inside the left means company table we have total eight records so it displays total eight records along with whatever is matching with the right table in the right table we have a, these three were matching right so remaining it shows null and then it displays the matching records as well so that is about left join now let's see right join okay so now it will display it has to display for left side what it it has shown all the records from uh, left table right so now all the records from right table along with the matching records which are there in the left table okay so let's see execute this here what are the in department we have only three records and those are matching with the left table as well so that it has to show only three records now see here it will show all the, see uh, you can have a, in a department table with the null id and another column then in department whatever another department is there that also will display okay because what are the uh, columns or records we have in a right table that it will display all the records so that is about right join now let's execute full outer join what it display it display all the records of uh, what left table as well as from right table all records it will display so that is the reason it display all okay so now let's execute cross join okay see cross join means it is kind of matrix so now here we have a records 3 right inside the second table we have 3 in first table we have 8 total 8 is 24 24 records it has to show it will multiply the whole records and then it will show you oh sorry only department that's it there is no id matching only cross join okay see here 24 rows got affected which means see for each and every left and right outer join right so each and every record will get match with the left and right table so total 24 records 8 into 23 records it got displayed so this is about cross join so i hope you understood very well about the joins if you have still any queries you can comment in the uh, comment box as well so that i can reply it to you uh, so If you like this video please do like and share with your friends as well uh, if you are visiting my channel for the first time please do subscribe don't forget to subscribe for getting uh, more updates okay thank you so much